Doop. Next up is area two, where we have one item there in the, the acid zone. Down there, there, past a plasma beam. Ooh, there's a whole bunch in the zone. At least looks like four. Uh, one, two, three, four. Four, yeah. So, where's the best way to go? This one. Alright. Up, down, and kill that bitch. I do love the environments in this game. They're so... varied and unique. It really does feel like you're going through a sprawling underground complex. Yeah. Are you serious with this? Yeah. It's called phase shift. Day. Oh, okay, I guess you can do that too. Yay! Why phase shift when I can power bomb? I mean, yeah. Okay, is there a teleporter closer than the. Uh, kinda? Yeah. Let's go back to the teleporter. It's because otherwise we'd have to go all the way around. Stop it! Raise the wings. Okay, so... We don't want to go to the bottom one. We want to go to this one. Samus has been destroyed. Data Samus is all there is now. Alright. Uh, we gotta go down hmm. this elevator. Which is another loading screen. Would you take a teleporter, Dave? Nope. No? Have you ever seen the movie The Prestige? I've heard of it several times, but I've never actually watched, seen it. So, you, are you okay if I spoil it for you? Yeah, well, sure. Okay. So, the whole point of The Prestige is that these two uh, magicians are trying to one-up each other. Right. And eventually, in their obsession for one-upping each other... <laughs> um... One of them develop, or one of them works with Nikola Tesla to right. develop a. Huh. Uh, to develop a thing that he okay. calls the teleporting man, which is a device that creates a clone uh, and teleports the clone about fifty feet in a specific direction. Okay. Uh, so that uh, there's two of you. Sure. And one guy is like, everybody's like, this is a master, uh, a masterpiece of modern engineering. But the magician is so obsessed with his rivalry that all he thinks to do is use it for a magic trick. Right. But the magic trick wouldn't work if people knew about the cloning. So the way right. he sets up the trick, and this is pretty twisted, is he stands in the device on the stage, is cloned and teleported, or is cloned and his clone teleports. Yeah. And then he kills the dude on stage by drowning him in a vat of water. Because there huh. can only be one. Right. And at the end, when he when his rival more or less figures out the trick. It's complicated. Um, he says, the one thing that I never knew every time that I performed the trick is whether or not I would be um, the one succeeding at the trick or the one in the tank. Uh. 
Yeah. And that's why I am not a fan of teleportation. Hmm, fair. There we go. Uh, it's right, it's gotta be underneath you, I think. There, yeah, there it is. Great. Uh. Alright, that is 94.4, the wave. Uh, then the last one is under that teleporter in the acid area. Okay. But yeah, teleportation as an idea is cool. I think the most that I would use it for is teleporting items. Yes. Which would be great. Instantaneous delivery? That'd be awesome. Of course. But teleporting people? Mm. You have to start. What, what? You have to start asking yourself some really philosophical questions when mm -hmm. you about to step into a teleporter. <laughs> like, how 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 much do you believe in a soul? Really, though. And does the soul hmm. go with the body, or does it? Is the body when the body is destroyed? Do you, die, and therefore there is no Technically, soul. Technically, you die, so... It's, it's mm. pretty messed up. Yeah? Yeah, no, I'll stick with uh, the Alcubi air drive. Yeah. Let's go to warp the cool way by twisting gravity like a bitch. Yeah. Or, you know, I guess a wormhole would work, too. Or anything where there's no anything, like, where you're actually physically moving. I Perfect. 100%. Uh, let's go back so that we're at a teleporter. Although, realistically speaking, if you can, te if you can teleport an object, what's stopping you from... Just using the end point teleporter to just manifest an object. Uh. Well, they say matter can neither be created or destroyed. So, presumably, the one end of the teleporter would be gathering the energy to manifest at the other end of the teleporter. Mm. There are a lot of items here. We've only, we haven't even gotten half of them. Oh, wow. Shit. That's a big zone, too. Oh, yeah. Wow. Well, look at that. That's a super missile door. Or a plasma beam. Or, that one oh, needs yeah. a power bomb. That one probably needs a power bomb. God, they're fucking everywhere. He yeah, has a lot oh, of them. There's one down in this That's hole. That's a purple door. Which is a wave beam door. Yeah. Now, that being said, I do believe that the teleporters in Metroid have probably figured out the whole soul mechanics. The Chozo seem pretty cool about that. I mean, there are actual literal ghosts in at least one in one of the games, yes. Which is canon. And it's very scary. Very scary. God, I fucking hate it. I avoid... I would go so far out of my way to avoid the Chozo ruins in Prime just so I wouldn't have to fight the ghosts anymore. <laughs> I hated fighting the ghosts. It was just such a pain in the ass. Oh, you need the x-ray visor, but that's the worst one! <laughs> and you have to kill them with the power beam, which takes the longest. But that's also the worst one! <laughs> yeah. It's frustrating. Honestly, I think the, the biggest problem with the Prime games, and this is kind of a weird thing to say, but, you know, it is, whatever, is that the the non-boss fights in that game take too long. Like, the yeah, when you fair. go up against the uh, the space pirate beam troopers, especially oh, yeah, the, the wave beam the troopers. Special, the special oh, there was pirate soldiers, there. yeah. The beam troopers, yeah. Those guys, oh. yeah. They, they are, they are strong. They, like, they are very, they are very strong enemies. Yeah, everything takes too much damage. It's not to say I don't love the prime games. 
still looking forward to Prime 4. Oh, absolutely. Do, 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 running around at the speed of Samus. Killing things by running into them. All right, why did I not get this item? Because it required the grapple beam and I didn't have it at that point. Got it. Yeah. No! It required the phase shift and I didn't oh, have it at yeah, that point. Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, hey. Alright, that's 18 super missiles. I believe you can get at most 25? It's a lot of super missiles. Don't quote me on that, though. Now, if we go up here, there's that item at the end of that magma tunnel that I know requires the gravity suit because it's full of lava. It's full of magma. Magma. Those movies are so timeless. God, I love those movies. I mean... <sighs> the jokes in them are cheap, but... They do make you laugh. And that's, at the, at the end of the day, it's a comedy movie, and that's what matters. Making you laugh. It's true. I mean... The whole zip it sequence is just comedy <laughs> gold. <laughs> Scott, you just don't get it. You don't. Look, I just get my gun, zip it. Shh. Shh, 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 shh. <laughs> Uh, look, look at me, I'm zippy long stockings. <laughs> like, <laughs> like that's actually funny. There's some moments in the in those movies that it's like you need you should be laughing at this, and I'm just like, but it's not funny. And they're like, but it is, and I'm like, no. But for what it's worth, yeah, I do enjoy them. Although, that being said, I think Mike Myers is a fucking asshole. Is he? I don't know I anything don't know. about him outside of those movies. Same. I but try not to pay any attention to any actors outside of their movies. That's fair. The only thing that I remember about him, other than the movies that he was in, and I'm going to go out on the limb here and say that the Trek movies it's in are the wall behind you. Is it? Oh, yeah. Um... Sean Connery got a Lifetime Achievement Award and Mike Myers had like a whole speech as part of it. Yeah. And a Lifetime Achievement Award is supposed to be about the person that you're honoring, right? Yeah. And the only line that I remember from Mike Myers' thing is, I owe this man my whole career. Without Sean Connery and James Bond, there'd be no Austin Powers. And I'm like, dude, shut up. <laughs> Nobody cares. Talk about Sean Connery. <laughs> Hmm. Well, I mean, he. No, he... I see. I don't. I don't see a problem with him saying that because he like he is saying that my, I uh, that he does owe his whole like he wouldn't have a career without Sean Connery. Yeah, I know. Like, I'm, I'm definitely overblowing it, but you're definitely just, yeah, definitely. It just struck me the wrong way and made me think mm. that he was an asshole. Maybe he's a nice guy. I don't know. I will say that a lot of his movies are crap. <laughs> I have not seen any of his movies outside of the Austin Powers movies. You've never seen Wayne's World? Which one? Wayne's World? No. Huh. Wayne's World is basically Austin I Powers, know, I've but heard, rock. I've, I've heard of it. Oh... No, I haven't seen it, but I can now. I'm now visualizing the character. Yes, I, I know of this movie. Okay.
Problem Power solved. Box. <laughs> Dude, you gotta do the puzzle right. But, but why? <laughs> I have power bombs. Your argument is invalid. <laughs> okay. Gotta go up and around. Oh, and we also gotta go through that whole digger bot section and get those items too. Yeah. I'm actually really upset that none of these upgrades so far have been a fucking energy tank. Christ, give me an energy tank or seven, please. Not that way. Damn hornitoads. Hornitoads. Hmm, ninjas. Oh no. Oh no, Kadathus. What? This might be a crystal problem. Uh. Oh, no, it's not. I can go up here. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Does your oh, phone normally okay. scare the shit out of you? Like, uh, I wasn't fuck. expecting it to start buzzing at me. That was just it telling me that dinner's almost here. Well, I'll be wrapping up soon, so you'll get some good eats. I ordered Popeyes today. Love that chicken for Pop. I don't think I've ever had Popeyes. Popeyes is really good. It's the best fried chicken in the town I live in. Mm. I've you ever... tried a bunch of it. Do you have a Swiss chalet? No. Have you been to a Swiss chalet? No. I really like Swiss chalet. <laughs> there was one. I used to live nearby one. In Vancouver, back in Vancouver when I lived there, mm -hmm. but I didn't have any money when I lived in that area uh, of Vancouver, so I never went. I mean, Swiss Chalet is kind of like the Denny's of chicken, so... Oh. It's oh, not, well, that it's doesn't, not usually expensive, That doesn't but... change the fact that I didn't have any money. Uh, no, no. Dave, I was, living, I was living in a room the size of my bathroom. Oh, Lord. It was very small. It was definitely not meant to be a bedroom. That was almost certainly like an office room, maybe. Maybe. Or maybe a glorified closet. <laughs> Good lord. It was very. Oh. Oh, never mind. I can do this. There you Yay, go. Yay, missiles. And while we're here. Is there anything up there? No, good. Okay, and that gets us to 81% of the items here, so doing pretty okay. Do, 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 do. Uh, that is a teleporter, which is very helpful, actually. Alright, there's an item up there. We can go to that teleporter to get that. There's an item down there. We can go to that teleporter to get that. No, we can't. Yes, we can. No, we can't. Shit, I gotta go back to mm. this one? I hate this stupid... This zone is not very fun. Funny. Well, it's funny ho-ho, not funny ha-ha. Ho-ho-ho. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, excuse me. Uh, 
All right, through here, drop down, go over here. I vaguely recall this. Fuck all of y'all. Oh, shit, it eats the fucking power bombs too. Oh, wow. It's one hell of a grinder. Oh no. It's fine. <laughs> hey, did it. Phase shift is really, really good. <laughs> it is. Like, it's sad that it drains so much Aeon energy because otherwise it would be really good in boss fights. But it's still pretty good. Oh, uh, hmm. a save station that we don't care about. I believe there's just... No, there's a couple items here. Alright, where am I going? There's that one up there, and there's that one down there. Okay. Shit. I guess I gotta get the teleport. Yeah, okay. I know where I'm going, Kina. It's good. Don't worry about it. Do you? Probably. I know where I'm going in the game. Everything else is up for debate. Okay. Up from here. This door. Up and over this way. Kill you. Giant flower, nobody cares. Yeah, no one gives a shit about the giant flower. I am the death blow, where are you going? <laughs> That one was kind of free. Hmm. Dave, I will be one second. I'm not being- no one's responding to me. I have to go and get- pick up the food at the door and bring give it to my folks. Okay. they're not paying attention. Take your time. Yeah. I will keep the internet entertained. Well, how's the fucking going, internet? How you doing? Ugh. Today is... The, the day that we're recording this is a Wednesday, November 6th. So, you know. It's a day. But I had that realization that... If things are gonna be tough, and I can pr bring people entertainment, I should do that. This isn't the right way, is it? I need to get to... I'm mean, gonna guess I can go this way. Could use the teleporter, but whatever. But yeah, we don't talk politics on the channel because I hate talking politics in general. Also, I'm not good at it. But, uh, yeah. I... I want to entertain and bring people enjoyment. So here I am. And if there's something that I can do to help people, then I'm damn well gonna do. So now watch me absolutely destroy these alien organisms and enjoy. Whee! 
Power bomb door. Power bomb door. No. Stop that. Power bomb tank. How many power bombs is that? Uh, 13, 13 power bombs. Okay, I'm back. You, you I've should gotten sort that of... situated. Yeah, I've gotten that situ them situated upstairs with the food with the dinner. Well, I'll eat. We... I'll eat later. Well, we're almost done. But the good news is, I got all of yep. the items in this area, I believe. Oh, nice. Nope, ninety-five point two. Where the fuck okay, am I missing an item? <sighs> Hmm. I don't see anything. That's bizarre. And the map looks complete. I don't see any obvious gaps. Except over there past the Metroid room, which... Right. Yeah, okay, that's like the only thing I... I mean, I there, that's the only there one. could it, be a door up there. It could be something. Let's see. I mean, I don't see anything else on the map, but... There doesn't appear to be any other gaps. Now. How? Pew 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 pew! Die, 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 die! Murder all aliens! I'm actually saving you from a horrible death at the hand of Metroid, probably. My story and I'm sticking to it. This is the right way. Alright, we go up this way. So we're up to 22 super missiles and 13 power bombs. And 186 missiles. And I believe I mentioned that there's only like 220 missiles total. Maybe less. 210. 210 missiles total. 210? I mean, yeah. Not 255? Correct. That's weird. Uh, so that means we need 89, 92. Wait, right. 89, 92, 95, 98, 201. So there's like about 10 missile tanks left. And even 210 missiles is massive overkill. I mean, it always is. They always give you so many missiles. I did like in Prime, they gave you a way to expend that crap load of missiles with, like, yeah. the super beam weapons. Even though most of them sucked. <laughs> the flame th flamethrower was bad. The wave buster was, inc was amazing. Okay, the flamethrower was bad, except in circumstances where you could stand next to people. Then it was Get right in amazing. something's face. I mean, yes. Where in the fuck... Is this goddamn the super item? missile was the super missile was good. The ice missile, the super ice missile was fine. Okay, so there's nothing there, huh? There's this there's one thing. Hmm. All right, everybody, hold on. Hmm. This is not helpful. Uh, there we go. 
All right. All right, so we've got a map here. Let's see where we need to go. So we cleared that, got that item, got that item. Got that one. That one, that one. That one. That one. Oh, this map isn't even complete, Kanathis. Oh, dear. Oh, why would it be uploaded if it's not filled out? Right? That's just, that's just sloppy. Oh. It's right here. What? Just, just under the teleporter. See that red dot? Yes. That's a oh. missile expansion. We oh. exposed it, but we didn't get it. I see. Fortunately... It's right next to a teleporter, and we're right next to a teleporter. Well, that makes it that somewhat easy. It's simpler. Uh, this one. This. Yep. Well, at least we figured it out pretty quick. Do do do. Why did we not get this one? I don't know. Power bomb makes everything easier. Done. <laughs> yeah. Power bombs. Well, the idea is you're supposed to go through because the fan is going to grab the bomb from yeah. the from the outside. But power bombs blow up everything, so fuck it. Yep. That's why we waited to get to get most of the upgrades because a lot of those puzzles, while fun, are completely invalidated by the power bomb. Power bombs! Which is also why it's the last item you get. Yeah. Alright, well, uh, next time on Character Select, more item collecting. Uh, 100, 100. Can't do that one. Area 4. Uh, this one... Looks like we got two, three, that's a digger room. Four, five, six. Damn, quite a few upgrades. Uh, but thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it. Hey, Knathis. Uh Yes, hi. Yes. Uh, next time we will finish this up and you will find the secret of the crystals. Okay, I am interested in that. <laughs>